morning everybody afternoon or evening whenever you're watching this um, this is gonna be a quick good morning message we are headed to day five of at home hemodialysis training um, hopefully we've gotten the issues we had straightened out and today we'll know that for sure but we are positive excited Jace is ready to go I'm ready to go it's actually extremely interesting to learn when you have a very good teacher so um, I will get videos if I can otherwise I'll let you know how it goes hey guys we are all finished up and heading home it is 3 15 we got done around 2 30 but today Casey got his first round of hepatitis B shot even though he had it when he was young he has to have another set um, and it's four shots total and he got his first round of pneumonia shot um, he does have a little bit of fluid in his lungs but nothing that is a pneumonia type thing it is swelling fluid fluid from swelling like um, like you swell in your legs or your hands or your ankles that kind of fluid so that's good and as I put in my notes or description from the video yesterday the whole be your own advocate thing is um, very very true because if you don't say anything you're not going to be heard we did say something and um, because we did we had an amazing outcome everything turned out really really good between everyone at the clinic including us um, Casey's care is top-notch um, my training is incredible and um, it just it worked out really well for us so I do highly suggest definitely always advocating for yourself and speaking up even if it's um, to just a nurse or doctor alone if you're uncomfortable with something they're doing or don't like something they're doing they're you know they're, they're used to accepting and taking your opinions even if they do seem like criticism that's the only way you're going to get things um, the way you want them or the right way or the way you feel they should be lots of different avenues there but anyhow um, to, like I said he got those shots um, today we figured out that by doing oxygen his legs don't cramp when we are pulling fluid so that's another thing that was pretty cool to realize because the cramping sucked cramping sucked right babe yep. <laughs> not fun so um that's about all for today today's a short one um the oxygen thing did scare me but when i realized what it was for um i was actually more comfortable with it and they pulled the fluid they needed to and he didn't cramp and he's cramped all the other times so it was a success and it worked so that's it for today i will update day six tomorrow Good night or good morning whenever you're watching this.